I mean, it's a Victorian pub from Cardiff. It was built sometime in the 1840s. We knew we know it existed in 1849 because it's in newspaper reports. And it was called the Vulcan Inn then. And then by 1915, they changed the name, they changed the facade of the building, and it's called the Vulcan Hotel. And it served um, a community known as Newtown. So about 200 houses um, on Tyndall Street, Adam Street. And um, that area is no longer there anymore. So that, that whole community has been dispersed. So we'll use this building to interpret their lives at around 1915 when Cardiff was at its height as a coal port. We're putting up the roof trusses today. So it's taken a while to get to this height. But once we can put the trusses up, the rafters will go on, then we slate the roof and then the building can dry on the inside and we can work under cover. There's plenty still to do. To, to do. Once the roof's covered, then we'll put the windows in. We need to restore the window frames. We need to restore the leaded windows that are on the front of the building. Um, we need to fit out the interior, put a bar in there, all the things you'd expect to find in a pub from this period. It's very similar to the original Vulcan. We've got access to all the architectural plans from 1901 right through and we surveyed the building ourselves in 2012 before taking it down. So we're very familiar with the building. This building is a millimetre accurate representation of the Vulcan, um, but we've set it in 1915. So inside, even though the layout will be the same, it won't look like the Vulcan we remember from before 2012. We hope to, build, to finish um, the building phase um, end of next year. So it'll take a while then for us to dress the building and prep it for opening. So we can't give a, an opening date as such, but around that time. People will be able to go in and buy a drink, yes, that's the point. That's how we're interpreting this pub really, by selling alcohol so people can have an immersive experience.